might be loud. Um, so you guys will have to let me know if it's like too loud. I get shit on in this game. I get uh, actually blame Hush, his newest video. I'm in this game getting shit on by him. <laughs> yeah, it was very different aiming in this game. So it was, um, it was a very different experience. How's the states? It was a good time. It was a great time. Really good time. Let me know if I need to bump the volume or drop it or anything like that. Okay. So let me know. Let me know. Okay. Want a more Titan Skate? Because it ruins the balance of the game. You're, if you have a shotgun, it's good. If you have a shotgun plus triple your normal top speed because of Titan Skating, it's really fucking good. It's hard to balance. Calm down. Yo, new fairy with a Twitch Prime You're sub. Thank you so much, man. Set the charges or defeat all hostiles. Wait, can you still Titan Skate? No. Let me know if the gameplay is way too loud, guys. I need to know. Only one minute left. Also, I don't even know what to fucking go on the map, so I'm, I'm a little lost. The worst! The worst! I'm the worst! Can't fight if you're all down. So Sargon D is blame hush. And he's already got three kills. Were you able to capture PC? No, nobody was. Nobody was. Are lightning grenades still good? Nope. They're really average. Well, once they proc, they're good, but right now they're uh, they're pretty average. I felt like it's not that my shots weren't connecting. It's just like the aim assist is a little different. I struggle. I struggle a lot. Enemy charge set. Defuse it now. And I was on a different system, so it felt a little weird to me, you know? Starting down. Starting down. Enemy team is down, but the charge is still active. So yeah, lightning grenade goes, it goes on the wall, and then it goes like... <laughs> if that makes sense. It, it hits the wall, and then it goes like a cone, goes woof, and then it starts firing. So you have a, you have a little wind-up time on the, on the, uh, Titan, or the lightning grenade. Are you salty about no 60 FPS on console? A little bit, but I'm gonna play on PC, so I don't personally feel that impacted. I'm gonna play on... Um, I'm gonna play on PS4 at the start and then swap over to PC after I get a bunch of exotics and shit. One minute left. Guardian down. Hush just sniped the shit out of me there. Yeah, it's, it looks like a trip mine. Yep, you're right. Thirty seconds. 
What do you think about the delayed release for PC? It sucks. Very bad. I wish it wasn't a thing. I hope they change it. I would love if they argued and changed it, but I don't know if it will. They got you all. Fight another. Yeah, I'm glad Striker's roaming too. What was the game game mode called? Countdown. It's like Counter Strike uh, CS:GO. Did you have any communication with your teammates in this gameplay? No. And like the buttons, like the controllers were like kind of shitty. Uh, like I wasn't used to the screen. I played like garbage. I felt bad. I wish I would have recorded more gameplay for you guys, but and like I had like a couple. Like 17 and 1 gameplays on PC, but I couldn't record them. And I had a 19 and 3 Titan gameplay, and I couldn't record that. Or no, I I, I did record it, but I didn't. It, the file didn't transfer, so I don't even fucking have it. It would have been so sick to show you. I got a like a four piece, um, 1v4, and it's gone forever. I can't find the file. So, uh. SMGs are just like doctrine of passing. Really? I don't know, all the- and like the- okay, one more thing. Where, where's the- how do I- So, like when we went to the Red Bull, um, Rift event? When was that? Taken King. Yeah, the Taken King Rift event. Um, all the weapons we had ended up being the worst archetypes of weapons. Like it had the Hawke, uh, pulse rifles with the four bursts. It had, um, like, a terrible sniper, um, like, Omelon sniper, like, the worst sniper with the worst scope. Um, it just, like, every every weapon we used was a bad archetype in the, in the meta. And I have a feeling this is the same thing. Like, some of these guns didn't feel the best. They felt pretty bad. There was a really slow-firing scout rifle. The hand cannon, I don't know, felt a little... Like, it was okay. I saw Lumi playing with it, and he did good, but meh. Honestly, the best gun was the auto rifle for me, and I don't have any major footage. I was just playing with it uh, before, and I I didn't really get to record with it. But we'll see. How did my mouse and keyboard feel? Amazing. Absolutely fucking amazing. I will not be playing PS4 by choice, but I have to for content. Because if, if the release is delayed on PC... Oh! Hush snipes me again. If the release is delayed on PC... Then I have to get content out first. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna wait three days to start grinding my character and get to exotics and get to legendaries and do reviews. You know, I have to do it ASAP. So I'll just play on PS4 and then, when I can, I'll switch to Destiny 2 uh, on PC. Uh, I doubt NLB will come back in its former glory. Or Uni or Vex because it would fuck up the animal ammo economy. They will not have shotguns or snipers as primary weapons in this game. I almost guarantee it. What do you think the metal will be? No fucking idea. There's so many guns that we've never tried. It's impossible to tell, dude. I wish I wish I could give you that info, but the guns we use were dick. Like they're a bag of dick. Left. I get shit on by Hush here. Now hold the line. Wrecked. Rank mode? Not that we know of. Oh, I'm not playing right now. This is just live gameplay. This is just this is just footage. Do you guys want me to play the strike mission? Do you guys want to see? Do you guys want to see the mission? It's like 24 minutes long, and I dick around in heart part of it, and I'm, it's like it's not very efficient. Or do you just want to see it? 
Are there any exotics or legendaries? Uh, well, the exotics are, like, really basic. They're just, like, hand cannons. Like, just, like, random hand cannons with... So, like... Oops. Um... The one hand cannon was, um... Like, a A solar one? And the exotic perk was just firefly. When you kill something, it would firefly and... It would blow up. But it wasn't, like, big explosion. It was really basic. I don't even know if they're legitimate exotics that are going to be in the game in that current... Like, some of the guns, maybe they're going to be completely different. It's hard to say. Thanks for the awesome streams, man. Keep up the good work. Ms. Shark! With a 10-month resub. Thank you so much. Enemy charging. Like I got I got shit on there with that scout versus hand cannon. Do you know what? I think both of them might uh con. I think both of the skill trees might have exotic or have that currency that you have to use to unlock it. Maybe. And it's just that one they had already done it. So I'm not I'm not sure how those skill trees work. And they might be completely different. Okay, sorry, I know I keep pausing it. One thing you guys need to remember is when they did the reveal. If you look at the UI of the weapons and the skill trees, they look completely different. Back in the beta, we could ascend our subclass and lock it in. They took that out from the end of the beta to the start of the game. So a lot of shit might change. Like the whole subclass um, skill tree might be different. How we unlock it might be different. This is an early build. Don't I, I wouldn't stress too much about that shit. Wait for the beta. Wait for the beta for a lot of those things. Because you just don't know. How good is Titan Barricade? It's okay, but you have to get bait, like... Set them and protect them. Wait. Well, oh. Um, the shield's good, but it's really meh. Would you say Destiny 2 is a huge improvement? Overall, yes. The PvE looks amazing. The PvP, we still need to test more, but, like, the game is fantastic. I had a ton of fun playing it. Charge is but um, I, I think this game PVE wise is gonna have some major longevity compared to Destiny One, so that's good. Guardian down. Slowing down the game dramatically, I don't think it's a bad thing. I think it's a great thing. I'm sick of getting one shot. I want to duel and have the opportunity to outplay you and beat you. I think Rumble will still be in the game. I think all the other game modes are 4v4, but I've never seen a game that doesn't have free for all in some sense. I guarantee there will be some sort of Rumble. I touch many butts, Visionaire. So many. Enemy charge is set. Defuse it before it blows. Woo! That melee, though. I got wrecked here. So he had an SMG, I had an SMG. I missed a bunch of shots. I think that's it though, I think we lose. Oh no, there's one more round. Did you hear the game isn't gonna have prime matches at release? Yes, I heard that. Uh, I mean, I've also heard that they're coming. So it might be just a matter of time before they bring them in. Is Destiny 2 already out? No, 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 no. Not even the beta. I don't know, I felt like the hit registration was a little off early on. But also, I just wasn't used to the setup they had going, so I can't be, I can't judge too hard on that. Your enemy has match point. Show them how little that means. The best example of Destiny's first gameplay in the Destiny One beta, so different. Oh yeah, and everyone was like, hand cannons are, okay. Dado made a video back in the beta, like hand cannons desperately need a, a buff. Hand cannons are one of the weakest weapons I've seen. They're almost unusable. Yeah, because the green and the blue hand cannons were shit. Little did we know that the legendary ones, um, 
And, you know, Hawkmoon and Thorn would be so fucking good that everyone in the entire game would use him. He had no idea. I had no idea. But that's what everyone was saying. Hand cannons are shit. Don't use them. The same thing might be going for these guns here. These, like, these guns might be the worst archetype. These might, this might be the worst scout rifle in the game. The worst SMG. And they just threw a bunch of weapons on for us to try, right? Maybe they don't want us to know what the meta is right away, you know? Are you disappointed with 30 FPS? Yeah, oh, we, yeah, I mean, every, I think everyone is, but for PvE, it's not really going to matter, and there's a ton of people that play PvE in this game, so um, for PvP, it does suck, but the, then I'm going to play on PC. Most of my stuff will be on PC. Can you Titan Skate? No. No, there is no 6v6 mode. 4v4, and most likely free for all. All right, that's the end. That's the end. One minute left. Um, do you guys want to see uh, another gameplay? Let me see. Guardian oh, I think I just get wrecked in this game. Also, look at look how much damage this melee does. Hold on. One minute. Okay, wa watch how little damage this melee does. Look at his health. Look at his health after a melee. So that means three melees to kill you. Three melees to kill you. That's right, boys. It's great. Also, Angel of Light being built in there kind of screwed me. But... Team has but not out again. I think I just got wrecked in this game. I like I didn't even know what I was doing. No, those classes are gone, user, I'm pretty sure. One minute left. I'm just trying to skip around, see if I get any kills or anything. Also, watch how long it takes me to kill someone with a sidearm here. Watch this. Watch this. Watch his sidearm. It does like 20 damage. Was Ankucha the reveal? No. Not that I saw. Only one minute left. down. Watch that again, baby. Oh, God. I want one more. I want one more. One more. One more. Let's see it again. Only one minute. It's crisp. And then I miss every other shot. So it looks like there's a bit of flinch. Watch when I try and snipe this hunter. Maybe I'm just missing, though. Maybe I'm missing, because Hush was landing some good shots. You know, I think I might have missed that over shoulder. Alright, this is the gunslinger guys. This is the strike gameplay. So if you guys have some questions, you can throw some questions, please. I think we're gonna we're gonna do uh Um Hey, no 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 no, what are you doing? Hey! There we go. Sorry, one second guys. Uh ba 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 Okay, slash slow 15. We're gonna throw it in slow mode. We're gonna do slash slow 30 seconds. You may send messages every 30 seconds. Please don't just spam the same questions. I'm gonna try my best to do it. While we go through this, this is a 25 minute gameplay. Ask some questions.
Yo, Agent DB with a brand new sub. Welcome to the goodness. Thank you so much. Did you like the squid emote? Ooh, yeah, that's good. How does our radar feel? Uh, it seems like when you crouch, you're off radar. Which is kind of nice. I'm not sure if it's for sure, but there was a couple times where someone snuck up on me through crouching, and I didn't know. The radar is a little bit less, um, a little bit less information, I would say. So it's kind of nice. Will Destiny 2 be competitive? It'll be more competitive because skill gap will matter. You will not see... Um, some of the people that, like, dominate Trials, ELO, will not be top-tier players. All they do is hard scope with icebreakers and stick people with grenades. People like Real Crafty, uh, with amazing gun skill, someone like that is going to still stick around. But there are people out there that are just hard scoper, grenade users, like me, and, and you gotta work on your gun skill. Someone that played Halo will do much better in Destiny 2 than they did in Destiny 1. I'll tell you that right now. It's all gun skill, man. Grenades are shit. Melees are shit. They're very, very average. It's all about gunplay. Uh, the ability to recharge seems to be in a sweet spot. What do you think? Um, it feels good. It feels good. It's a little slow. It's not too. Uh, it's not too bad. Um, you can't rely on it. That's the nice thing. I liked it. I liked it a lot. <laughs> How is the new shade step? I need to test it more. It seemed Welcome pretty chill. You're gonna see it a bunch this in this gameplay. I like the reload mechanic. Wide. I think the reload mechanic is really fucking cool. Wide. So you Commander, can do DPS and then shade step and reload. You're gonna notice. Rate. Okay, I'm gonna pause. It Check the audio. Um, so you're gonna notice I'm gonna miss a lot of uh, crits on the just on PVE enemies. This is the first time I touch the game. It feels very weird. Um, the aim assist is a little bit different. The range on the guns, I'm not sure. Can I use my hand cannon here? Can I not use it? So, um, there is definitely a lot of me looking like I suck cocks at this game. I mean, I think, I think at this point we're used to it, right? Right? But anyways, it's, uh, you just, just, just enjoy, okay? Did you ever get pulled out of your menu? Yes, you do. It fucking sucks. They still pull you out of menus. It's the worst. Did aim assist and lock feel different? Yes, it did, Jay Black. I can't explain it. I don't know yet if it's less aim assist or I'm just not used to the screens or what. We'll know more in the beta once we get to test it. Don't you think guns look way cooler? Some of them look Several awesome. Key vex systems. We have detected a series of seismic disruptions. The cabal may be responsible. Uh, do you know what, Agent? It might a little bit. It's tough to say until we until we really see what the meta is. And there's. There's like three classes we haven't tried yet, and so maybe their class abilities are way better than what we use. Uh, yes, yes it does, but it doesn't always one-shot people in supers. I think you have to shoot them twice. The golden gun with the six shots. Do the menus feel faster? Ah, uh, they were crisp. I wasn't dicking around in my menus too much, though. How are the AI? Uh, the AI were stronger. A little bit, I think. Um, like, there's some um, flares. Or not flares. Um, the Cabal... Uh, the Cabal Scion. The Cabal Scion, and they have sniper rifles. You'll see them in here, I think, a little bit. And uh, they would flank you. And they would, like... If you didn't deal with them, they'd pump you. So, it was kind of cool. You'll see. You'll see it later on in the strike. Can you block rockets with the Titan Shield ability? I haven't tried it enough. We don't know yet. Scions. Yeah, Scions, Scions, Scions. Is there still Sprint Lock? No. Or Slide Lock. It looks like you can go Sprint, Slide, Sprint, Slide, Sprint, Slide. I'm pretty sure. That's Mr. Fruit, by the way. Uh, Fat Kitty is Mr. Fruit, and the other guy is Say No to Rage. So, this is a Fruit, a Fruit Rage Tash Sandwich. The audio cues are great. You can hear people's footsteps better. Pete, um, big fan. Does mid-air accuracy feel better on primaries? Uh, need more testing. It felt okay, but I'm not sure. Uh, I jump sniped someone, though, and it hit. So, I don't know. Oh, look, look, it's a Vex milk waterfall. Can we stop and... Aww. I think the audio is messed up there, because he just goes, aww, without anyone replying to him. I think they need to add an audio line there that maybe they haven't yet. 
See, there's, a, there's a guy sniping me right there. And if you don't deal with them, they just they pump you. Like, they fucking destroy your health. Okay. And you're gonna notice a lot of times that I'm, like, switching weapons and reloading at weird times and putting away. I kept getting very disoriented having two primary weapons. I kept going, oh shit, is this my sniper? Is this my scout? Is this my fuck? Like... I don't know what it was, but I found it very weird. He, he said, oh, because you flew right past it? I know, but the timing of it is a little, uh, it's just a little off. Like, you need, I don't know, they need to work on that, I think, a bit. Um, you cannot skate anymore. No. No, no, you can't Titan skate. The Warlock jumps are slower. The only thing I can think of is Titans hitting the roof, like, da, da, da. you might be able to. How's the tick refresh rate? It's 30 FPS. PC is amazing, guys. PC frame rates. Oh my god, jizz in my ear. It's so nice. It's amazing. It's honestly so good. It's so good. Is a Red Legion a reskin or are they different? Uh, there's different. There's there's melee ones. There's these float. There's like uh, centurions that'll that'll use Angel of Light, and there's some different enemies. Everything's got different enemies. I saw the, the the Vex have a couple different ones we haven't seen fully yet. But, okay, so at the same time, like, you're in the same universe. This is a sequel. It's not going to be all different enemies on a whole new world. I'm sure some of the other worlds will have different enemies, maybe. But it's, I mean, it's a sequel, guys. Right? It's going to be very similar. It's just new um, experiences. Do you think a $700 Acer laptop can run D2? I have no idea on the specs yet. I have no idea. Oh, we're walking into the light. I think there's a metaphor here. The new shade step cooldown, like maybe like 20, 30 seconds. Next time I use it, count it down. I think I use it down here. Watch this. I jump snipe this guy. Watch. I don't know if that's luck or I was aiming. It seemed like it was a legitimate snipe. Did you play against Fallen? I don't think so. Just Cabal and Vex. How cow with a six month resub. Yo, dude, I'm resubbing. I hope your channel dies before DQ comes out and I hope you're not good at life. Haha, get roasted. You kidding me? You better watch yourself, cow, before I kick you in the penis. I'll kick it! Will there be three subclasses for each character or two until DLC? I want to say two. Voidwalker and Dawnblade for Warlock. Sentinel Striker for Titan. Arc Dancer or Pole Dancer. And Golden Gun. I want to say there's two. If there's, if there's a third one we have no idea about. Okay. That's pretty cool. But we'll have to see. 100 bits from Devil's Prodigy. Thank you so much, man. Did you use a fusion rifle? No. The areas we went through in this strike, though, is beautiful. It was beautiful. What the Red Legion possibly be drilling for? Friendly query, what have you done to attract such hostile species to my planet? Or Bubble Titans rip? I think so. See, there's a new Cabal. He's got a melee. And they slam the ground and they can boost over to you. They do like a shade step towards you and slam. So if you get too close, they're gonna fuck you up, is what they're gonna do. I'm telling you right now. It, see, like, look at my aim, boys! It's the worst! I tried to switch up my guns a little bit for you guys. Is sniping any different? A little bit. Uh, we need to see... We need to see the... Um, if there's other scopes. If there's other snipers. If it's just like a couple generic ones that are all the same. We have to see. I'm not sure CBB Blade. So 
look at my cooldown and shade step here. What is this? 20 seconds, maybe? I'm thinking like 20 seconds. Twenty-five? Thirty? So I didn't realize how quickly that was gonna run out, so I wasted a bunch of charges. Seemed like a twenty yeah. I'm not a, uh, this is footage. This is not me playing. Well, it is me playing, but it's not, uh, it's not life. And of course, the drills have armed crews. If it's helpful, I suggest you deal with the drills when the shooting stops. The shooting never stops. My aim was so bad. There's a Colossus, Red Legion Colossus. But he's got like a gra uh, like an arc, an arc grenade launcher. Save your grenades for the guys with the shields because they, uh, they're annoying. Also, uh, he, you might notice that I'm shooting 900 times at his shield. It's because I, where I was sitting, I was kind of far away. I couldn't, like, see if I was hitting his shoulder. I wasn't meaning to do it. I'm not that bad. I love the new and diverse reload animations. Yeah, they're looking, they're looking damn good. The graphics look cartoon. It looks like Destiny One to me. Cryptbox so feel know, different, maybe a I little bit. A massive Vex energy signature. And the only way to reach it is down past those giant pointy drill bits. It does feel more like Halo than Destiny Good. 1 for PvP, but PvE still feels very Destiny. There's big abilities, there's big explosions, there's lots of fun. I like it. We'll know more in the beta though. Grenade is 30 seconds. Okay. Look at my little sil silenced pistol. Woo! Female Titans finally have a better ass. Woo! Oh, female hunters. Yeah. So I'm actually playing this with Mr. Fruit and Say No to Rain. Sidearms, once again, aren't the best for PvE. Neither are the SMGs. They're for PvP. These guys get right up in your grill. It's great. Look at that. Look at that little play there. Watch that again. Do you like pussy? Yeah, man. So much. So when you shade step, it reloads your gun. Fifteen shots. Go back. When you shade step, it reloads your gun, and I get fifteen shots back in my sidearm, and I didn't realize that. Um, so I, I switched weapons, but I could have just used that sidearm. Ready? Steady. It's gonna reload right after the shade step. Reload. So that's pretty cool. Very cool. They're called war beasts. Super magnificent gl glutes. Yeah.
terrible super easy. I hope this is safe. Kabob. PC version looked that good. The PC version looked way better than console. It looked unreal. It looked so good. Like a mate. Uh, mm -hmm. ah, amazing. Like really, 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 really good. I don't need to stick the landing. We do. Um, I would still play Striker Titan over pretty much every class. Striker Titan feels sick. Here, this guy, look. This guy's suicide kills me. Watch. He jumps on top of me and blows up. Twenty-two second cooldown shade step seems a bit much. It was too spammy as it is right now. No one would fucking fight you because they just sh shade step twenty four seven. It's amazing. I'm so happy. What do you think of the stronger class he played so far? I mean, Dawn Blade is great, but the Striker Titan was great. The Striker Titan was good. I loved the super. Will they jizz their pants when playing PC? Guardian Most will. Down. It's good. It's really good. Will Sunbreaker be back? No, but you can just play Dawnblade. Here, wait, hold on. So I think I think they were sniping Mr. Fruit from a distance here. Hold on. Oh yeah, so he I think he got sniped by all these scions. Wild man with an eight month resub. Welcome back to the Goonies, you crispy little minx. Oh my god, it's so crispy. Thank you so much. At least 10 seconds would be nice. No, I do not want spam. You might, absolutely. I get it. I appreciate your your um I, I understand where you're coming from, but me, I'm pumped. The less shade step, the less Twilight Garrison, the better. For me. For me. But not for everyone. I get it. But I just, I do not like abilities like that. They find, uh, or they make PvP very frustrating. Oh, How'd you feel about 4v4? Alright, let me do a little, I'm gonna do a video. I'm gonna do an entire video on this. <clears throat> I, I'm gonna do an entire video on this comment. 4v4? 4v4? Why are they making it more competitive? What about 6v6 for the casual players like me? Right? That's a very popular statement. Why 4v4? Why is there less players? Why is it more sweaty? Why is there not 6 players making it eight, you know, easy to find people and kill them? When there's 6 players on the map, there is six players that are trying to kill you. And there are two more players that are going to flank you. When you have six players on the map, you run into more engagements that aren't rewarding because there are six more players, you know, anywhere on that map that are trying to kill you. And so what ends up happening is even if you do find someone and you catch them off guard, there's someone else finding you and catching you off guard. And what ends up happening is long term, and maybe you notice it, maybe you don't, with more people on the map, the more times you get killed without any way to counter it or have a meaningful engagement. With four players, it brings up the speed from the 3v3 we had, and it brings down the bullshit from the 6v6. Personally, from anything I've experienced, 4v4 and on the map sizes that I've seen plays out very, very well. So that's that's kind of my argument is like 6v6 is a clusterfuck. I, I, back in the day, Crucible School, day one, I said, if you play 6v6, you are literally running into a lobby where you have unrewarding gunfights and, and it's it's like ability spam. It's just, it's not like good for improving. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. What was I going to say? It, yeah, it's not really good for improving. And then 3v3 was really slow. But anyways, let's keep watching. Respawn and my dog gets it. Oh god, I missed it! Woo, wow, what did you say? Oh, he said hi. Okay, hi. <laughs> okay, watch me keep getting wrecked by these things. I kept getting fucked up in the in the blenders, boys. This was such a cool area though. Hold on. Let's this. look at that again. Look how cool this area is. I really, really, really 
hope that there is some sexy areas like this. Like, you know, I feel immersed. There's the, I think it's the Jupiter planet. It's like a huge methane ocean. Like, I don't know. I feel like there could be some really cool scenery. But look at this. Like, there's these fucking big blenders coming at you, grinding away. If you get hit with, with one, oh my god, you're going to see what happens. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. This is just fine. Oh shit! Ah! I got blended. I got blended. Why is Battle.net better than Steam? I don't know, it's a great launcher. And there's only so many games on Battle.net, so... There's a bunch of players playing Overwatch and they see one other game. It's a, you know, there's Hearthstone, there's Destiny 2. There's like one other shooter game on all of Battle.net. So... Hey, maybe I don't feel like Overwatch. I'm gonna pick up Destiny. It'll be great for the audience. It'll be great. We got Mr. Fruit here using the super. Woo! Anti-cheat? Yeah, there's anti-cheat on Battle.net. Get hyped. Get excited. Guardian down. We also, we couldn't figure out where to go. Oh, and then I was testing if I could go on here. You can't go on here. <laughs> you can't go on here. Get off. Get. Uh, pro creativeness question. Do you think Void Walker Warlock still have blink as a movement ability? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they do. Uh, somewhere in the skill tree, I'm not sure. Mr. Fruit is the Warlock, is he? Are you sure about that? Oh, maybe he is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe he is. Okay, so that's the same order rage. That's the striker. Uh, anyways, pro creativeness. Uh, there has to be blink. Ikara Ray was using it. Akora. Ah, Figured out what character you're gonna start with. Uh, I gotta, I gotta try it out. I gotta try out the other ones. I don't know yet. I haven't decided. I think I might start out with the Sentinel Titan just because it looks fun. Um, and then I have Striker to fall back on after both classes that I love. I keep getting fucked up. So, I'm gonna go Sentinel and then Striker Titan, maybe, which would be fun. And then, um, oh, and then I'll probably do the Pole Dancer. Mayor Eris is missing? Yeah, maybe. I'm not sure. I don't know. Uh, revive seem faster. All right, here. One second. So, in games with revives, from what we could see in Countdown, you start off in the bottom corner, like down in this corner of your screen, with a yellow token. If you have a yellow token, uh, I have no idea, Infanova. I'm thinking that Tether is not in the game anymore. I don't think Tether's in the game. Anyways, in games with revives, you have a little token here. And if someone dies, you can revive them. But then that token is gone, and you can't revive them again. If you die before using the token, it's gone as well. So you can't spam revives. You pretty much get one revive each. And it'll actually tell you how many the other team has. So you know, like, oh, we don't have to deal with any more revives. Like, let's just camp the zone. So, it's cool. Will they show more at E3? Oh, yeah. Way more at E3. Here it is. not reloading my guns. I kept canceling them. Yeah, exactly, Ryan. Exactly. Uh, hey. You play the PC version? It was so much smoother. It's not even funny. I will, uh, as soon as I get enough guns to show off on PS4, I will go on PC. But if there's a delayed launch of PC, then I'm going to start on PS4, get as far as I can, and then come back. And then, uh, and then I'll switch later on. You're in the wrong directory? I know. I'm a bag of dicks. We 
Wait, does the token allow you to let uh, allow you to revive someone else or allow you to be revived? Yes, it does. And then when the token's gone, you're you're done. It's out. You're done. You're not coming back. No chance. No way. No how. It's over. You're done. You're done. Hey, hey! I was watching that. Was it harder to hit crit shots? Yeah, but I think I just wasn't aiming well. I just think I think I was just missing. I doubt the speaker's dead. You know he's not dead. Watch your feet. All right. See, this is the exotic. When you shoot the exotic, it would, um, it was like Firefly, but not, it was, you didn't have to crit. Was that six Golden God shots? Yep. Did I just see you mantle something? I might have. Let me see. Oh, shit! What the fuck? Did I mantle that? Watch, watch, watch. Watch the animation. <gasps> Shut the fuck up! I think we just discovered something. I think we just discovered something, guys. I don't know if anyone has talked about this or or uh, or or seen this. Did we just discover something? That's known. Is it known? Okay. Okay. I see. I didn't know that. There's vaulting. There's mantling. I, see, I didn't even fucking notice. Thank you. Okay, cool. Watch your feet. You mantle now so much better. Awesome. Okay, so, so from what what we tested, um, it seems that the elemental weapons are less damage. When you're using it against an elemental type, they rock them. They rock them. They'll drop shields so quick. But it seems that they want you to use your primary, and your elemental one is just when you need it. Because I was looking at the damage. Like, look at the damage in my hand cannon shots. Oh, uh, well. No, do you know what? It's okay. But I'm, I'm critting for, like, 153 with this. Wait, 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 wait. Is it the exact same damage? 95, 151. 76, 151. 50, 150, 150, 110. So the scout rifle, and it might be the the archetype. Uh, game Sager, yeah, you were, dude. Here, let me just mod you so I can see you in chat better. Um, you're the best. You know what? It, it might not even be that different. But anyways, the elemental ones would rock the shields. Um, so I guess you know what? You can use it as a primary weapon. Uh, I I don't know. They seem to have a little bit lower ammo count than some of the other ones. But ah uh, mm, ah uh, nope. Mm. I'm not going to speculate too much. There's just too much, too much new shit. We got to test out. Did the new exotics feel exotic? Not really. They were pretty basic, dude. The, the, um, the machine gun was okay for the Titan. My aim is a big bag of dicks, though. Why does it look like Overwatch? It looks like Destiny. How the fuck does this look like Overwatch? It literally just looks like Destiny in the new environment. Is there a light level? Yes. Maybe. I don't know. Um, are there any subclasses you that they haven't shown? 
do you know what? I don't. I think there's two. I think there's Titan and Sentinel, Art, uh, Pole Dancer and Gun, uh, Golden Gun, Gunslinger, and then Dawn Blade and uh, Warlock. I think Nova. Or, uh, Nova Bomb. Yeah, I don't know. And maybe there's the other ones that they got revamped. Who knows? That would be a lot of content. Okay. Okay. We lost all our light. Right? We, we lost all our light. We have to do quests to get our light level back. If there was two subclasses, and we got to grind them up, we've got six subclasses to deal with. That's Destiny 1, right? That's, that's de what we had in Destiny 1 was two each. And it would be a lot of content. If there was another subclass, there was three. Maybe Night Stalker is still in it. Maybe Sunbreaker is still in it. Maybe, uh, you know, Stormcaller is somewhere still in there. But what if there was all of them? There was a there was a Sunsinger. There's all these. If there was four subclasses at the start of Destiny 2, we lose everything. We have to grind it up. That's a, that's a lot. How would Destiny 2 launching with less subclasses than D1 has currently be an improvement? Oh, I don't I don't think I said that. I didn't I don't think I said that at all. I just said it would be like Destiny 1 because we had two like we had two subclasses at the start of Destiny 1. And it took me forever to level them up. Like I don't know how long it's going to actually take. And we also don't know if the skill trees are the skill trees. Like it might be uh, much expanded. So in the beta I think or in the alpha it said you could ascend your subclass. That was not a thing. Uh, before the uh, the the UI or whatever for the guns um, for the uh, for the subclasses it looked completely different and then they changed it so I don't know I don't want to I honestly the stats side of it um, you know the the actual perks in there I don't know if that's official yet There's a currency user on level them up? Yeah, I wonder how you get that currency though. Okay, so... Hold on. So I'm gonna use all my shots here. Shade step, it reloads my gun and I start shooting. So I obviously don't have this, like, perfectly timed, but I feel like this could be a good... Uh, DPS boost to your gunslinger. You shoot all your shots, shade step jump, you know, shoot some more. Watch this. But also, you might be locked up in an animation, so it might be like 50% faster to get those shots. I don't know. Not sure. Um, also, you might notice the boss didn't drop any loot. No engrams. It might come at the end of the game. Maybe. We don't know. It might just be because of this build. Is it actually called Shade Step? I don't know. I think it's just Dodge Roll. Do you know if it reloads both guns? No. Fuck, dude. Oh, think how much DPS that would be. That would be so sick. Load him with, with, with your, uh, you know, like, land him with your scout. Switch your hand cannon. Shoot him. Shade Step. Hand cannon back to your scout. Maybe by then, you know, you switch to heavy a little bit. And then Shade Step again. Oh, my God. I would fucking... <laughs> I would blow my load if that was true. Think of how mechanically good you could get switching between three weapons, reloading them with that shade step. Oh my god. It would be amazing. It would be so sick. It would be a lot more like MMO rotations. Think about it. Think about it, dude. It would be like a, a full-on rotation. One gun, one gun, shade step. Gun, gun, heavy shade step. You know, like there would be a, there'd be like a, a cadence to it to maximize your DPS. I wish. Please, Deej, yo, Deej, come on, <laughs> come on, Deej, you gotta, you gotta bring me that, you gotta, you gotta bring me it. It's not getting up from that. Zavala, we're good. Yo, what's up, Nebby? Well done. Nebby. What's your assessment of this incident? Vex records indicate the Cabal discovered the mine and dug into this world to capture it. It doesn't. Yes. Had yes, Janston, it doesn't. I'm just saying goal. it would be fucking I awesome if it did. A 60% chance this if it would reload your other gun. In the Luckily, the captain stepped so cool. in. Hey, look at that. Look at that. The, uh, the ghost has resource detection on Nessus. 
So it seems that it still has that function. It's kind of cool. I don't know. Does my current gear carry over? Yes, dude. Look at this. Ooh, ooh Mr. Fruit with the with the plays. Say no to rage. The PVE god coming up a little weak though with 70 kills, only 13 precision. That just goes to show how hard it was to land your shots. It was it was a little difficult to land your shots. I'm not going to lie. Intellect discipline strength doesn't seem to be there. Cooldowns are locked behind a gate. And they're, they're, that's it. This is the cooldown. You cannot change it. But you can change your recovery, your armor, your speed. Um, so. Tell me that auto climb. You know, I saw that there's auto climb. I saw it. I saw it. Okay, here. Let's look. Let's look here. This is the subclass for Dawnblade. I like it. So the grenades are the pretty much the exact same. Not a big change. You can change cooldowns? No, I don't think you can. No, I don't think you can. I'm om I'm almost positive it's universal. So the healing rift. Um I'm gonna go back to that quick. Wait, what? <clears throat> the healing rift is not an instant OP thing. It's something you need to stand in for a while. It seems to give you an overshield. I, I don't know. I got in a couple duels and they were in overshield, so they, I think they were in the healing rift. Um, but it's not like a really instant, super powerful heal. Like, it's not going to give you like half your health back or anything like that. If you're in a duel with someone, he pops his rift. If you keep shooting him, you'll kill him. He will not outduel you. If he gets behind cover and you don't push him and you don't force him, you just fucked yourself in the engagement. So it's something that you really do need. Oh, maybe, and sorry, yeah, maybe there is an armor perk, but I just mean like. Uh, like, directly, like, intellect discipline bringing it down. And maybe there's some exotics that bring down grenades or give you an extra one. Like, who knows? But anyways, yeah, this gives you an overshield. Healing Rift is a little slow. you got to rush up and, and shoot him, though. Like, if you don't, if you leave him in the Rift, he's going to heal. The damage one, I didn't test it. I didn't test how much damage, what percentage is. Um, oh, and the other thing, too, is the second you leave it, your overshield goes away. So if you build up an overshield in the zone, it'll go away the second you leave. Use regen from corners and half behind cover. Yeah, so half of it's behind cover, half of it is, is, is out of cover. And you can kind of keep strafing in it, getting safe and heal. The rift health doesn't heal you more than the damage you take from bullets. 100%. You cannot tank. Very much. Like, if they leave you in there for a bit and then... And then they come and engage on you, like, you might you might heal up enough to take, like, two more shots, but it's because you you heal, then your regen is kicking in, like, there's a bunch of, a bunch of stuff. 20% buff, really? 20% buff, that's pretty strong. I have no idea, Infanova, I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet. So yeah, the Empowering Rift is the same, like, AoE kind of thing. I like the Healing Rift. These jumps change things a bit. We need to test what's actually fastest, but I like this. I like this. So, fire starter. This is kind of like Surge from the Voidwalker. Increase your movement and your reload speed. So, that's pretty sexy. Yeah, and if you can optimize, so yeah, half toes. 20% damage boost on something on a 30 second cooldown seems pretty strong. Absolutely. If you coordinate in a strike and you're, you know, popping them down together. That's, I think they'd be very good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Slick, but you're not going to get weapons of light every 30 seconds. Think of, like, over the course of a strike, how if you optimize it, what you could do as a team. But yeah, so this is like Surge from Voidwalker. This looks to be Twilight Garrison. Maybe not as aggressive, maybe not as fast. If you look at the, the shade step on the Hunter, you can see him the whole time. It's not, like, a super aggressive dodge. So maybe this is just like a quick like, hey, <laughs> you know, you know, hey, I'm here. Oh, wow. I'm over here now. Oh, oh what's this? Oh, wow. Hey, hey. Uh, oh, <laughs> you know, it's not going to be um, 
I hope, not as aggressive. Because with Twilight Garrison, it is evasive. If you're shooting at someone and they garrison, it's like, fuck, I cannot hit him anymore. So I'm thinking this is just a little bit more subtle, a little bit more toned down. I mean, you're floating in the air. You don't have a fucking jetpack, right? It's maybe it's just like, maybe you're in the air and you're just like, oh, uh, oh, God, uh, oh, <laughs> whoa. You know what I mean? It's just like a little, uh, little dodge. We'll see. Who knows? Uh, this one is pretty cool. So extending your duration, pretty nice. You're throwing down your swords, you're blowing people up, you get a longer super. I like that. Uh, and then wildfire. Um, I, so, okay, so when you glide now, like when you're flying through the air and you, and you use your boost, it, uh, it stops you when you throw a grenade, don't you? You drop down when you throw a grenade or you shoot. I think now you just keep floating. So I... I don't really like that myself. When I like, I, I don't want to be floating in the air and a target. So we'll have to see how this interacts. I do not like the Baron skill tree. I know it might not be. Maybe there's another attunement. So this up at the top here, you can see attunement of sky. Maybe this is attunement of fire. Maybe there's a third one. Maybe these aren't even fully things. You know, like I don't. I feel like there's got to be more. At the same time, they did say that they want it to be a little bit toned down, a little bit more subtle. But still, I I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not going to speculate too much about the subclasses yet. I just don't want to freak out about it if they do change it. But if they don't, it'll be a little bit disappointing. Uh, explicit with a Twitch Prime sub. Welcome to the... Goodness. Thanks. Oh, there is two choices. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. So yeah, and then like all these ones are are like, I don't know, I don't like them. Here, I'll show you skydive. Um, left. Oh wait. Set the charges or destroy. I think I do the the skydive in this one here. A couple times. This is from my video yesterday, so I know if you've already seen this, I'm sorry. One minute left. See, I miss. Hold on. I want to see how many times I shoot this Titan. I think only one shot. Connects. One minute left. Okay. Oh, maybe two. Maybe two. It just didn't seem like it. Charge Miss is what? Set. Neb, you subbed? Protective. It doesn't say it on my alerts anywhere. It doesn't say it on my uh, my alert thing. Refresh it and see if you have to share it. Maybe then it'll pop up. Good. Refresh the stream, Neb. But I see it now. Yeah, I see it now. Enemy approaching. Defend the charges or defeat your opponent. Our SMG's hit scan. Um, I'm not sure. Do you know what? I'm not. I'm not even sure. And I was sitting far, like kind of far away, and I couldn't like. I, it. My duels didn't feel very cozy, because I wasn't used to the setup, and uh, I, it was hard to tell. I don't want to say it is hit scan. Wait, is it hit scan? No, it felt like it was kind of like chunky. Like it took time. How are the melees? I mean, melees suck dick in this game. I I think the me like it's three sh it's a three melee kill, right? If you have an empowered one, it'll hit hard, but if you don't, you do not want to be melee. Watch this. Watch how shitty this melee is. Watch his health. One. Two. He's still got like a quarter of his health. One minute. Oh, range-wise? Uh, they're about the same. 
Karn Leage with the Twitch Prime sub. Look forward to Crucible School for D2. Oh, baby, there is a lot. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at that body shot. Woo! Mama Gaga! If they're dead. Mama Gaga! The best in the league. Set the charges and protect them. <laughs> and caged. Ooh, gotcha, Carmilla. Okay, cool. Good info. Good info. Yeah, it looks like they do replace dual wounds then. Watching videos. Oh, yo, Sensora. Thanks so much for using my scuff code, man. You gotta send me a picture when you get it. Sub. He's got the black badge of sexy now. Woo! Blaco, thank you so much for that sub, my dude. Defend the charges and defeat your opponents. Looks like grenades take a second to impact, uh, to activate when they impact the surface now. Maybe a little bit, yeah. I'm not sure. Yeah, have they posted the specs of PC yet? I'm kind of mad they didn't invite N. Cooch. What? Wait, wait, wait. They didn't invite N. Cooch? I thought he just couldn't make it. Did they actually not invite N. Cooch? What? Really? No, he just couldn't make it. Or did they legit not invite him? That's fucked up. He's got like 300 and some thousand subs. Yo, long ball with a, with a seven month resub. They did invite him, he declined. Long ball, seven month resub. Thank you so much, my dude. They didn't invite Sir D? Yeah, I knew about that. Uh, there's some more Skyfalls at the end. Ryan. The enemy team is down, but the charge is still active. Diffuse it. Diffuse. Yo, thanks so much, Long. You appreciate it, man. Is solid. I feel like I should just post this gameplay and AMA on like YouTube even though it's so long and unscripted Set and terrible and protect them with your life you know a joker boss I saw it I'm going to E3 uh, I don't think I can make it due to time constraints I got invited um, but I also don't want to pay for like watch watch me get this stolen from me you kidding me I got it back. It's all good. When is E3? Like June 10th? One minute. Kind of sucks because I wish there was more now. footage to cap. But. Now, Alright. Watch that. Ow. Watch this guy. Watch this guy shit on me with his evasion. Very nice. Very nice. Watch. Battle. I missed like 40 bullets on this guy with that evasion. It's nice. They can't win if they're dead. <laughs> so much empty space. Match point. I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to see, we'll have to see once we start playing it. I mean, the other thing too is if you hold down a sniper lane 
I don't know, you might be able to make some shit happen. I actually don't like clusters. I, I like setup engagements that take some time. I don't like dealing with six opponents. I find it so annoying. One minute. You have this. Phoenix dive. And it, you can't do it over and over and over again. You gotta wait. Phoenix dive. It's like a five second cooldown. And Zavala said Cabal bombs would make poor training tools. All right. <laughs> All right. So that's, uh, that's Destiny 2. <clears throat> I wish I had more footage. I wish I had more footage. But if you guys have any more questions, just try and throw them in the chat and I'll...